In this problem, we're going to do a proportional reasoning problem that involves using a price per pound of a food item. At the market, one pound of bananas cost 49 cents. Rachel bought three pounds, 12 ounces of bananas. What was her total charge before tax? So what we need to do is we need to set up a proportion in order to solve this. Now we got to decide also if we want to do this problem in pounds or ounces. Now let's go ahead and do it in pounds. So we know that one pound of bananas costs 49 cents, so we'll just do it in pounds and cents and we'll convert at the end. Now we need to figure out how much three pounds twelve ounces costs of bananas. Now remember there is sixteen ounces in one pound. All right. Therefore twelve ounces out of sixteen ounces is three-fourths. So that's three-fourths of a pound. Now if we look at how we're setting up the proportion, we did pounds on top and bananas on bottom. So we need to keep our other ratio that way. So we know that this one on top will be three and three quarters pounds and the cost will be on bottom. So maybe we should write cost of bananas. and That's what we're looking for so we'll call that X. Here's our proportion. We've got to make sure that we're either lined up horizontally or vertically. We could have done x over 49 equals th 3 and 3 fourths over 1. That would have worked as well. What we're going to do now is cross multiply. So we get x equals 3 and 3 fourths times 49. Now we need to go ahead and solve this. Use our calculator, 3 and 3 fourths. I'm going to go ahead and use 3.75 times 49. And there's our total cost. So x equals 183.75. Now, 183.75 dollars is quite a bit for 3 and 3 quarters pounds of bananas. Remember, we did this problem in cents. So, what we're going to want to do is round this up. So, maybe we'll use 184, and then we're going to move the decimal point two places to get it back into dollars. So, the, the three, quarter, three and three quarters pounds of bananas cost a dollar eighty-four. The big thing in setting up a proportional reasoning problem is make sure you have the like types either horizontally across or vertically up and down, never diagonally. 